Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you three ways to generate random colours using JavaScript. There are completely random colours, only nice random colours, and colours of a specific hue or luminosity. So let's get started. I am here in VS Code and as you will see I have a single div with a class of colours and an ID of all colours and this is what I will use to generate completely random colours and to do that head over to the JS first of all grab that element by doing const all colours equals document dot get element by ID and then all colours and then onto all colours we add an event listener which listens for the click and then runs a function generate all colors and we will write that function now so we do function generate all colors and then we create a variable called hex and that will be the hashtag or pound sign plus this calculation and this is something you can find if you just google how to generate random color with js i did not write this myself i just found it on the internet you can also copy it from here should you wish so now we want to add that hex color as the background color of the all colors div and to do that we do all colors dot style dot background color equals hex so let's give that a go Whoa, our colors are changing randomly now this might be all you need to do to get a random color but there is one problem with it and that is that it can generate any available hex color including the murky and unattractive ones so not to pick on any in particular but you see as i click through some of them are considerably nicer than others so how can we find a way to generate only nice colors i will show you now to do this we're going to use the random color tool and what this does is it generates only attractive colors by default meaning bright colors with a reasonably high saturation to use this you just head over to the randomcolor.llllll.com site and then in the examples follow the instructions to add random color js to your page namely clicking this and then you can either run it in your browser or on the server and i'm going to go with the browser option which means i should click through to the latest minified version of random color and copy the minified script tag and then put that in the head of my html so now i have loaded random color into my project it's time to generate some beautiful colors and to do that i'm going to add in a second div so we can compare the two so copy this and then this can be called nice colors and then a lot of the code is quite similar so i'll just label this with a quick comment and then copy it down so this will be nice colors and then we're going to have const nice colors which is document dot get element by id nice colors and then just switch out all the other instances of all and replace them with nice so when it comes to generating the nice color very easy to do you can actually generate the nice color and change the background of this dot in one line and that looks like this nice colors dot style dot background color equals and then simply call random color let's give that a go woo yeah beautiful brightly colored nicely saturated hues perfect but you may have in mind to generate random colors of a specific type so if we take a look at the random color page you'll see that you're able to specify whether you want red yellow green and you can also say whether you want dark or light and to do that we just add one more color div and i'll call this specific colors and then very similar function so i will just copy this down and change nice to specific and then where we have called random color we can state what type of color we like either with the hue so let's say i want pink and i would usually want pink this will now only generate different shades of pink i actually think some of these are purple but let's not get into that discussion and then to 
change the luminosity, you simply state luminosity and then whether you want dark or light. I will hit up dark. Let's give that a go. Woo! Only dark pinks are entering the building. And just to prove to you that this does generate all the different colours, give yellow and light a go. There we have it. Only light yellows. Perfecto. And interestingly, if you put random here and here, this will generate random colours. So it's essentially doing the same thing as the first one. But that's not the only thing you can do. No, you can also pass in a hexadecimal colour of your choice and use that to generate other colours. So as we all know, my favourite colour of all time is hot pink, which I happen to know is this hex code. So let's see what happens when we generate colours based on that. Whoa, dark pinks and reds and greys. Interesting. Well, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed learning about random colour and we'll be generating lots of beautiful colours in your project sometime ooh, <laughs> soon. Let me know in the comments what your favourite colour is and what you're going to use random colour to create. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.